everyone. I'm so excited that you are here with me today because today we are going to talk about numbers and we are going to talk about one number that sometimes gets forgotten, but it's an important number. Before we do that, can you count to 10 with me? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten. We are going to talk about a number that we didn't even hear when we counted to ten. Because today, we are going to talk about the number that comes before you even get to one. We are going to talk about the number zero. Can you see this crayon box here? Zero. There are no crayons in the crayon box. Hmm, zero. I have a special basket. It's a basket filled with bears. Can you see my bears in the basket? I also have what I like to call my counting cup. My counting cup is fun. He is a smiley face counting cup, but he's pretty big, pretty heavy counting cup. Is there anything inside my counting cup? Maybe just a little dirt. I should probably wash my counting cup. My counting cup doesn't have anything in it. How many bears are in this cup? There are no bears. There are zero bears in the counting cup because zero is none. Just like there are zero crayons in this crayon box on this poster. Zero. I want to practice writing the number zero together. Zero looks a little bit Sometimes people call it a circle. They say it looks like a circle. It does a little, but it's a little bit longer than a circle, almost like an oval. But it is similar because it goes around and around. So let's practice writing it together. I'm going to write it on my board with my special marker. You can practice with your finger in the air and I have a little song to help us out. Are you ready? If you are ready, clap your hands two times. Awesome. You are ready. Here we go. Listen to the song as I do it and then we'll sing it together. Round and round like a superhero. Around and around like a superhero. Around and around like a superhero. Yes, you made a zero. Do you think you could sing it with me? I'm going to make another zero over here. I'm going to make it I'll make this one a little smaller because even if I make it big or I make it really tiny, is it still a zero? It is still a zero. So I'm going to make it a little smaller over here. Can you sing that song with me? Around and around like a superhero. Around and around like a superhero. Around and around like a superhero. Yes, you made a zero. Awesome. So you start at the top and you go around to make your zero. You are going to have some practice making zeros because I have a very special mini book for you that your teacher might give you. It's called a mini book because it's small. It's a small book. It says my mini book of, what number is that? Zero. It says colored by, you're going to put your name there because you're going to color it. And inside, it has the number zero. Is there anything in that cup? No. Is there anything in that jar? No cookies or candy in that jar, so there is zero. What about this? Just like our poster, zero crayons in the crayon box. There are none there. So you're going to trace your zeros and color your pictures. And I hope that you had fun singing your zero song with me today. Will you practice it and let me know how it goes? Have a great day. Thanks for joining us for the lesson. At the Kindergarten Connection, we are all about making learning fun for students and for teachers. Be sure you check out the quick links below or head to thekindergartenconnection.com where you can get more resources for your classroom and request your invitation to our pre-K and kindergarten teacher membership, the Print and Play Club. Happy teaching!